Hello everyone, I'm Himanshu from Interazo. We are here at Brigade Cornerstone Utopia to showcase our 3 BHK interiors, which is owned by Pratibha and Shashank. Over here at the entry, what we have, we have a foil unit, we have a brown mirror work along with the PVDT profiles with some hanging lamps and a fall ceiling and down lighter. In the living area, we have designed an entertainment unit which is completely wall to wall of approximately 12 feet. We have a base unit which has four drawers and a space in middle for a set-up box or a Blu-ray player. On the left of it, we have designed a taller unit with spots. We have a complete wall panel with a white laminate and a fluted panels with the PVD profiles. We have a space for three plus two seater sofa and a center table. On the wall, we have a wall decor with a decorative light. We have done a periphery fall ceiling with a down lighters and a cove lighting. In the dining area, we have a puja unit, which is a complete open puja unit with a fluted glass, with a tray, drawer and a storage in the bottom. Next to it, we have a crockery unit with some rose gold shutters with a clear glass. We have Blum Aventos lift up systems over here again. Soft close, another one is tip on. And next to it we have a wine rack and a storage in the bottom. All our units are completely handleless in the entire house. We have done a false ceiling cutout to hide a curtain track. Let me show you this space savior parallel kitchen. What we have over here, we have a Sanderson acrylic in the base unit as well as in the loft area. We have used the ivory color and a off-white in the loft area. In the wall unit, we have open cabinet which we have used a merino laminate over here and a tinted glass shutters with Blum Aventos HKS. The bottom one is soft closure. And the top one is tip on shutters. And any product of Blum comes with 15 years of warranty from the brand itself. The countertop what we have used is Kalinga Venatino which has very thin waves and we have done a 40 mm in the front and you don't see any line of a sandwich joint. We do a mitre joint over here. The same has been continued in the wall dado as well. So you get a complete flawless feel. We have hob and chimney from Halfley. Under the hob we have three drawers which is from Blum and these are tandem box. We have a space for cutlery, another one for cup and saucer, and another one for plates. Next to it, we have two more drawers, which is basically for storage for pans and everything. Next to it, we have planner space for a gas cylinder. Left of the hob, we have a space for a bottle pullout, which is for spices and oil bottles. In the utility, we have a space for storage with the pull-out shelves. 
and a storage for cleaning agents. On the other side, we have a taller unit with two drawers, again from Blum. A microwave from Hafle. It is basically a combi or oven and microwave combi. And the model is Diamond 50MWO. We have three wicker baskets, which is for like you can have onion, potatoes or fruits, all these separately. Next to it, we have a sink, which is from Carousel. It's a quartz sink. And we have placed a water purifier under the sink, which is from Kent. We have a SS sink on the other side, in the utility side. We have used a bedroom passage area as a family wall. We have given a track and a spot on top. In the master bedroom, we have designed the entire room with a theme of white and matte gold. We have an Aristo wardrobe over here, which is floor to ceiling with a lacquered glass. We have a matte gold profile shutters. Inside the wardrobe, we have a space for hanger. We have a space for top for storage, which is called as loft. A multi-purpose insert for accessories, which is basically for watches, belts, and some earrings. We have a space for locker. Underneath, we have a drawer for storage, which is from Epco. And that's a complete draw system from Epco, not just the side channels. We have a king size cot over here, which is manufactured by us with a designer quilting. The fabric what we have used is from D-Decor. Our king size cot is a motorized bed, comes up with the help of a remote, where you don't have to lift your bed and it can handle a mattress weight of up to 100 kgs. And the wall panel what we have is mix of fluted panel and a plain surface with a mirror. On the other side in the master bedroom, we have designed a TV base unit and we have a dressing base unit over here with a round mirror and with the edge we have done a deco paint on it with a cove lighting behind the mirror. We have done a fall ceiling which is a periphery fall ceiling with a down lighters and a cove lighting with hanging lamps. Kids bedroom has been designed with a theme of white, sky blue and a navy blue. We have a single cot of 4 by 6.5 size with a wall decor over here. We have a quilted headboard from a D decor over here. We have an Aristo wardrobe which is completely floor to ceiling. And over here we have designed a hanger space with couple of shelves, two drawers and couple of shelves in the bottom. Next to it we have given a window seating with a roll up blinds. Next to it we have an open storage for toys and which can be used as a bookshelf. And we have a study unit with a wall unit, which is a mix of open and closed shutters. We have a periphery fall ceiling with the drop lights in the bottom. In the guest bedroom, we have designed it with a floor to ceiling Aristo wardrobe. We have kept a theme of light gray and a yellow mix. We have a queen size bed with a storage with a quilted headboard and a wall design. A periphery fall ceiling with a down lighters, cove lighting and we have a cutout for curtains so that you don't see a curtain track. On the other side we have a study unit with a wall unit. In the study wall unit we have underneath profile lighting with a completely handleless wall unit again with Blum lift up. And we have a ledge over here, we have a writing board and we have planned a panel for a switchboard because this is a my one construction, we cannot do switch shifting over here. The storage on the bottom, the space for printer, the space for a dustbin so that we, it serves as a home office as well.
In the guest bathroom, we have a base unit with a cove lighting mirror and the storage on the left hand side. Hi, I'm Shashank. Hi, I'm Pratibha. We reached out to Interazo for our interiors for a 3 BHK apartment that we newly brought. The things that we liked about Interazo was the transparency in quotation. They were very approachable on every aspect. So we had a few things in our mind which we discussed it with our designer and it came out really well. Overall, it has been a very good journey with them. Um, we had to do very minimal follow-ups on anything. They were more of uh, very proactive in every aspect. And even the apartment was delivered before time. So I really recommend it to anyone who's looking for interiors and making their home uh, like a dream come true.